Hello guys and welcome to the gaming news for the 5th of October 2021. So the Alan Wake remaster releases today. So if you didn't get a chance to play it before, now's your chance to jump in. It's not that expensive, like in the UK it was $24.99. So I will be playing it hopefully today and checking it out. And the review from IGN was very interesting and actually quite funny. Uh, but they were saying that it does have smooth graphics and really good frame rate and so on but it doesn't provide that much of a leap compared to the original game in case you did actually play the original game but it might be worth checking out anyway it's completely up to you because they've added a director's commentary to the game like you get on um the old dvd box set and then the next bit of news for today is epic games are adding achievements to the Epic Game Store. So it's just like with Steam, that when you reach certain points in the game, you'll earn achievements, simple as that. So it's a long requested feature of the Epic Game Store and is coming very, very soon. And uh, the last bit of news for today was yesterday there was a Facebook outage. So everything that was associated with Facebook was down for a few hours. So Facebook, Instagram, Oculus, WhatsApp, everything they own. And let me quickly explain why that happened. So when you type in a web address on your internet browser, whether it's Google Chrome or otherwise, the browser uses something called DNS to look up the IP address of the website it's looking for. So DNS stands for Domain Name Service. Now, basically, the configuration of the Facebook um, DNS was changed yesterday, let's say. And so when people typed in facebook.com or anything associated with facebook.com, they couldn't find it. So it couldn't find the IP address of the Facebook website. Therefore, it appeared down, even though it probably in the background was actually running if you knew what the IP address was. But people just type in facebook.com. They don't type in IP addresses. And that's why that domain name service exists to help you get to websites quicker. So if you actually know what you're doing, like in my case, for example, I've changed the DNS settings of my router to Google DNS because it's quicker than my internet provider's built-in DNS. But if you don't know anything about DNS, I would say don't mess with it. But basically, that's what happened. And that's why I took a few hours to update and change and fix. Because when a DNS changes, let's say um, Facebook.com is now pointing to this IP address and so on. It has to go through every single major route around the entire globe. So given that at one point the DNS setting was wrong, it means that it went around the entire world uh, to say the wrong address. Therefore, no one could find the website. As simple as that. That's why it was a global outage for a few hours. So there was nothing wrong with the servers. There was no data should be lost. Everything is completely fine. People just couldn't find the website. Simple as that. But now, as far as I'm aware, it's completely resolved. And the memes that have been released online because of it have just been hilarious. So, yeah. But that explains it. Hopefully, if you want more context, just please reach out to me in the comment section. And I will get back to you about it and give you, hopefully, a bit more explanation if you want to know more about DNS. So, um, anyway, guys, that's it for the gaming news for today. And uh, thank you so much for the new followers coming onto the feed, as always. And I will see you tomorrow. Thanks, guys. Bye-bye.